Hey guys, what is up? It is Dylan here. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we're back on Vectory. Now, uh, let's just get started. So I have to, uh, I have to show you guys some of the things I've been working on before we get started. So let me show you the rich cup of water first. All right, so this is more of an art thing that I'm doing. So this right here, uh, this is just like the layers and then this is the mug and that's why I call it a rich cup of water because the mug is gold Then there's water uh, It's not really but you know whatever and then ice cubes. So yeah, and then this is the viewing layer and <clears throat> Yeah, this is kind of just another little art thing. So let me show you the next one, which is called The hot rich cup of hot chocolate. Let's go all right, in my opinion, I think the hot chocolate looks better than the rich or the, you know, the rich cup of water. I think the rich hot chocolate looks better. I don't know. I just think my artwork in this one was a little bit better. But yeah, I also have the viewing layer. That, that's kind of an everything when I have art. That's just that way I don't mess anything up or that way I don't have to undo it. It's just like a way that way I don't have to worry about anything. So, uh. Let's move on to the flags I have created. A few of you know that I have made flags on here, but some of you don't for the ones that are only on YouTube. Uh, so let's go right to all the flags. Oh, first I'm gonna do Canada. All right guys, so this is the Canadian flag I've made. Uh, I have different layers. I have plenty of layers in this one, just like the Slovakia one. Um, so this is the leaf part of it, the outside, which is the red part, like on that. Inside is the white part of the flag. Uh, Canadian font plates that's like the the shininess behind the Canada font then I added like little gold spheres to make nails Canadian font heart just saying I love Canada and then having a viewing and yes Canada is where I'm from that's why I love it so much and that's why I worked on this but I also worked on Slovakia so I also love Slovakia uh, that, that's kind of where Vectory's office is from and the reason I love Slovakia is because I love Vectory. So let's go right there and I'll show you. All right. And this one I had to use a little bit more layers because it's just there's more parts to the Slovakia flag. So I the same thing. I added the plate and I added the nails or the spheres that look like nails. I added the font and plus I added the Slovakia, the whole thing. So yeah i kind of popped out that part i uh, added all the things and then yeah it took me a little bit but you know that's fine it's always okay to spend some time getting better so let's go to my dashboard and uh, i'll show you one of my public projects i just posted and then we'll start getting crafting all right this is the vector hat that i made it's kind of public so i'll go over here to my public over here thingy and then yeah see it's public and then uh my private i still got one more on my private to do before i can public anything or publish anything so yeah here's the rich cup of water we got the hot chocolate we got the canadian flag and we got the slovakia flag so now we're gonna get into the tutorial enough chitter chatting and let's go all right guys i'm gonna show you how you can um i guess make a, a hot chocolate or water uh in this sense we're gonna make hot chocolate because it looks cool so what you want to start out is getting this top view you're going to want to go to cylinder i mean it is pretty obvious then you're going to want to make about right here you just going to kind of eyeball this we can change it with the radius and go about right here and then you're going to go to right <coughs> radial segment <coughs> put that to 12 you're going to go to height segments and you're gonna put that to seven all right and then uh, you can change your height and radius however you like it uh, i'm just gonna make a hot chocolate mug all right that seems cool uh you can close ends that's just gonna make a hole right through it uh but <laughs> you don't need to do that because we're gonna delete the top so then you'll have this then uh you, do, you don't want to make the uh the mug like the holding part of it yet so uh what you want to do is you just want to select all the top faces and then delete them uh delete this all right so once you've selected all the top faces and deleted them like that 
you're gonna go to selections jog select all you're gonna hit e for extrude and uh, you're gonna go outside like that about 5.88 that's what i want you guys to put into the thing the bar 5.88 and then you'll have what i have for thickness wise so then there's your cup and then now we have to make the handle part of it so you're gonna go to select faces and you're gonna select a top and a bottom doesn't matter where just you know you're gonna v on your keyboard or over here go to bridge um then you're gonna go to the side you're gonna go to segments i usually put it at 10 uh so we're just gonna put the segments at 10 that that just makes it look better and i usually put the strength at 1.72 all right there is your cup then you're then you're basically done the cup part of it uh so you're just gonna want to make it gold so that way it's a rich cup of hot chocolate because it's it tastes great so there you go there is your awesomeness cup and now we're gonna move on to the next layer oh yeah make sure you label your layers so you don't get mixed up so we're just gonna put hot choco or yeah chocolate all right hot chocolate now we're gonna move on to the next layer or no, no, no this isn't hot chocolate this is mug mug slash cup there now we're gonna move on to the hot cho chocolate part i almost got mixed up so then you're gonna go to add empty layer you're gonna name this hot chocolate i almost got mixed up all right then you're gonna take sphere <coughs> or uh, cylinder not sphere you're gonna go to the middle and you're gonna try to do this perfectly all right and this is just making the inside look real so hold on let me take a look uh so you want to go about right here until it's like inside the thing so right, right there and then when you make it higher because of the smoothing it might it's gonna shave it down so you're gonna want to go about right here almost to the top uh you're gonna put uh radius uh, until it, you can just barely see it like that Because then smoothing will shape it out throughout the cup and radial segments are gonna be at 12 like always because 12 is just easier It's kind of like a middle. I don't know. Um, so then you're gonna have that and Then there it is. So turn on smoothing uh, That's really smooth. I didn't expect that much smoothing um that's that's awesome not really all right uh let me be right uh i uh, know no maybe you don't turn on smoothing i uh, actually yeah no you leave it so hold on i guess maybe you you would make it smaller <laughs> i don't know it didn't do this for when i made it so this is kind of confusing um uh, i guess we'll just keep going or, uh, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Um, yeah, I totally got no clue. Maybe you could stretch it out a little bit. No, <laughs> I don't know. All right, we're just going to leave it like that then. Uh, anyways, you're going to go to the hot chocolate and you're going to make it look brown. I mean, it already looks brown, but we're going to make it look chocolatey. All right, so there's your brown hot chocolate. We're gonna make it a uh, uh, noise. <laughs> noise. Uh, all right. There you go. Uh, maybe we can actually slim it down because that's a little bit high up for hot chocolate. I mean, you definitely wouldn't want to spill that on yourself, right? So let's let's just try to make it look the best, and we're gonna make it go down a little bit. Hit E and. Yeah, 4.91. And then, yeah, then once you're done that, you're going to add the marshmallows. Add empty layer. You're going to go to marshmallows. I'm pretty sure it's how you spell it. And then once you have that, you're going to go to 
uh, draw a cylinder and what you're gonna do is uh, you can just add like a few you don't have to add as many as I did because it kind of takes a long time and it gets annoying so you about marshmallows like that um, and once you have that I want you guys to go to select all the selections jog then you're gonna go copy selection and now you guys have never done this but I mean if you, you might have and it's kind of cool you go to paste selection and all you're gonna do is drag the white thingy and it gives you another one Wow magic paste selection gives me another one whoa right isn't that cool all right now we're gonna finish doing uh we're gonna slim this one down too because we don't want to just have them all down like that and then one up there we go and then you're just gonna select the way and you're gonna go select all and we're just gonna move them around a little bit make them look groovy oh yeah no go to local local makes them all weird and stuff yeah all right then once you have that you're gonna go to textured you're gonna go to white uh, you're gonna turn on smoothing and yeah there you go there are your marshmallows and uh yeah that's kind of how you make a hot chocolate in vectory uh thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy this amazing tutorial uh next video i will be trying to make or uh, helping you guys try to make the uh water the the rich cup of water so yeah guys don't miss out it is an awesome thing you don't want to miss all right so make sure you leave a like and make sure you subscribe and i am totally out of this so bye